Hey, I'm Christian Savitak. I'm here today to show you how to do Smith Grind tail grabs. So to do Smith Grind tail grabs, first you want to learn how to do real good Smith Grinds. Mm -hmm. Get them so you have them like nice and locked in there and you can really like sit on it. Once you get really comfortable with just like, you know, locking it in and sitting on there, you just start reaching down to grab your tail, you know, and as you get better and better, you just can travel them longer, have a little more time and just grab the tail. It's kind of all one motion as you're pulling in, you're, you're, you're lifting it up, you're helping it up off the coping. I just let go as I'm going in, like lift and let go, I guess, I don't know. This happens fast. First, you can do it just doing a Smith stall and you know grabbing your tail and lifting it out. Um, if you want to do that, to get more comfortable with it. But for me, it's it seems to be easier to just get a good long Smith grind, you know, to where you're sitting on it for a while and you have that time to you know reach down and grab the tail. Don't be bummed out if like your thumb grabs your foot. That happens to me a lot. Like, you know, your foot will be here and you go to grab your tail and you're, you know your thumb's grabbing your shoe, whatever, it's no big deal, it happens. You got short arms and you're gonna have to squat down a lot. You got freaking spider monkey arms then it's just right there for you. Do it down a handrail, whatever. Do it on the top of a fire hydrant. I don't care where you do it. You can do it wherever you want. I just like to do them on ramps. Today we're going to start skating at the most convenient spot we call Queen's Park. 